So I'm just walking down Costco. I was headed to the bakery section and then these caught my eye in the middle of the aisle in like just some random electronics and glassware. They have these carts with these beautiful real trees and they have these little lights in them. Do you see the battery packs? For $21.99. Look at the gorgeous pot. And they're like a pretend flocked, I guess. They're so pretty. I'll go down the home the home goods, I guess you can consider this. These are so big, these bowls. I actually need some new mixing bowls, but not that large. I've eyed these a few times and I'm hoping that they would go on sale but they still haven't. If they hopefully go down to like $11.99 I think they're just so beautiful. They're ceramic and they have a removable top and they just look really nice for the car too. They have some really nice thermoses and gift sets here. You can take things apart as well. Don't forget, like if it comes with three or two in one, just take them apart and gift them separately in, you know, a nice little gift bag. You don't have to gift the entire set. not too bad they're large baskets and there's two of them two storage baskets but they're not real they're plastic pretend like wicker look which is not too bad because then they last a long time nice for organizing your linens and things like that in your closet they're really nice yeah faux wicker basket Who has one of these? The Cricut Maker. It's very pretty. It looks quite similar to, oh, I like the top. It's nice. It has like a metal finish. It's very pretty. So this is an alt light. And it's a little bit different than the one I have, but I absolutely love it on my craft table. It has a really nice lighting system. You can change it to, with just the tap, and it's just perfect if you're a paper crafter. That's reasonably priced. 25 markers on for, on sale for $13.99 and they're the Sharpie. Especially if you have a little artist in your family who likes to use them, it's a great price. Oh, I'm actually needing a new carpet cover for my desk area. I was looking at Ikea, but I'm wondering if this one's better priced. These are my go-to storage containers in my pantry, the OXO, and I love them because of the way they seal. They have a little pop-up button here, and then they just press down, and you just put your things away. It's super convenient. This is a beautiful set actually, nine pieces, pop container set, that's what they're called. Ooh, these are cute too, cold tumblers. Who has a robot vacuum and how do you love it? If you have any feedback, I'd love to hear in the comments down below what you think of your robot, which one's your favorite if you have one, or what you use. I know that the KitchenAid is an expensive, expensive appliance, but look at this. I'd say this is a pretty good value because it comes with all the extra pieces. And then there's the Cuisinart one, which is half the price, but 
Yeah, you have a couple options here. Do these teak benches hold up with water? Is that something that this wood holds up well with? I'm not saying to put it in the shower, but if it does get wet, does it hold up well? A few years back, we purchased some a, like a portable night light as well and it turns into a flashlight so it's charging constantly and if the power goes out then you can unplug it and then just walk around the house with the flashlight but these are pretty cute because they're color changing LEDs and they look like they're a power failure night light as well oh, I might have to buy some of this for the winter safe paw ice melter with the with little bear it's probably a good idea to have this Oh, I wish they had these Grinchy trees last year when I had that Grinch themed little setup in the living room would have been cute to have one of these. I love this tin too. Indoor or outdoor. A few years back I bought one of the really thick rolls here from that were reversible, had two prints, one on one side. I think it was bare, larger than this roll here. But it lasted me so many years that I almost got tired of looking at it after all that time. So if you're a paper crafter, you will see these as embellishments for crafting with because they're just so cute. You can even make cards. Look at the little gnome. You can plop it on the front of a plain card and transform these little embellishments. I really like their potpourri bags, not for their smell or anything, but just for the decor. It's so, they have some really unique pieces in here. Um, my last year's bag had almost like a coral looking piece and I love it. I just have it in a big bowl with a, yeah, just a big bowl. I don't even have a candle in it. I always buy their holiday napkins, but I use cloth napkins for the most part, but they just, their price is really reasonable for a big giant pack, and the quality of their napkins are nice too. This is a pretty hand-painted nativity set, and they're big pieces. Oh, cute little nutcracker guy. This is beautiful. It's battery operated and it's one of those snow globes that finally the snow is twinkling the entire time. So pretty. That's the one thing with snow globes, right? You turn it upside down once and then like everything settles. But this one here, they did it where it's just constant, constantly moving. Oh, they have some fun LED type decor. Look at this vintage tree. How freaking cute. And the Mickey one, it looks like it's supposed to actually move. It's supposed to be animated, but maybe it's not turned on. These are actually LED light up mirrors. It's kind of hard to tell, but I don't want to stand in front of it for my reflection. <gasps> Look at this wooden snowman, how cute at the front entrance of a house. It's really large.
Wait, he is really cute. Almost reminds me of like Bennington there. He's really sweet. I like the snowman. Something else that I'd have to store away though. Oh, I think I'm gonna grab one of these as a gift. They're beautiful. I actually have to go get a ton of things. So I just did my like wandering shopping and now I actually have to go do my real shopping. So I think I'm gonna, so I'm gonna say goodbye here. I hope you enjoyed walking around the store with me. I'm in the checkout line. There's a big long line from the front to the back of the store and this just caught my attention. So I thought I'd take a quick peek but I'm back in line. Anyways, till next time. Bye, everyone.